All right. Uh, recording has begun. All right. It's the next day. I have spent a few minutes going over the squad's equipment and levels and such, so we're good there. I need to spend a few points. I wanted to make sure and save this for the actual recording. Um, I thought about it. I do want to keep my charm and intimidate maxed out as much as I can, because those extra dialogue options, you know, they give me extra dialogue options. Those are pretty important for the story. So I do want to pick that up. And I have been neglecting Spectre training. I took a while to read through some of these more fully. Because when you're recording, you have a certain... Uh, there's a certain impetus to keep the... Keep the momentum. Keep the inertia. Keep the whole thing moving forward. So while I wasn't recording, I went through and looked at some of this stuff. I've been neglecting Spectre training a little bit. It does a whole lot. Uh, increase, it, it's, it's a good all-around pick. So we And we have access to the full line already. So I want to put a couple points in this. Doop, doop. And assault rifles are what I've been or what I have been mostly using. So let's put the remaining point in assault rifles. I think I kinda wanna go assault rifles. Um I'll probably pick up advanced shield boost and combat armor, but I'll probably leave it there. And then focus the rest on assault rifles, Spectre training, and charm and intimidate. So I think we'll do that. I don't think we can go further with Soldier. I don't know if there's something I need to do with my skills or a certain point I reach in the game where the rest of these open up. So, I don't know. But for now, that's the plan. Assault Rifles, Spectre Training, and the Dialogue Options. Because Soldier's already good. What's fitness for me? Oh, uh, and you know, Advanced Immunity might be good, but we can kind of leave Immunity where it is. I think we're good there. And these two, obviously, level up on their own. So, we're good. Let's roll, baby. We gotta go find Liara's evil stepmother. Or just, just evil mother. Whoa. Okay, good. Whoa! Doesn't that look cool? Like, not temperature-wise, you know what I'm talking about? Why you gotta be such a pedant? <laughs> Off we go! Man, it's gorgeous out here. I'm not usually a fan of snow and ice levels in games, or water levels for that matter. The Zelda Water Temple, the Zelda Ocarina of Time Water Temple is genuine PTSD inducing stuff for those of us who grew up in the era when Ocarina of Time was new. Yeah, in that era of gaming, especially, <laughs> that water temple is definitely something that will live. Where am I going? I'm just driving. <laughs> Wherever. Ah, oh, it's just a straight shot. No offshoots or anything. Good to know. That means we can keep rolling. Whoa, I love the way the lights look, though. And the music and everything, and the way we can only see the sun through the haze. That's so cool. I don't remember what the first Mass Effect looked like, so to me, this is just what the game looks like. I don't know if these are, like, really big graphical enhancements or what. Oh! Enemies spotted on radar. Aha! Whoa! These guys are a horribly ineffective line of defense. Just the worst. I'm just getting so much experience. This is free. This is just free. Period. Still see some marks over there on the radar. And alloop! That didn't go as high as I figured it would. They're a little bit further in, it looks like. And there's still some guys, like, off to the left, outside of the covered area. Bridge? It's a bridge. It's a bridge? It's a bridge. All right, let's play. Woohoo! Oh, who took lo What the? Dude, these guys... These guys' weapons do literally nothing. 
This is so freaking free. <laughs> At the feet. <laughs> uh, why is this so free? I don't like this. They only do this kind of thing in games to make you feel strong right before they drop like a mega boss on you. Why are there so many guards on these bridges? Are they aware that I'm coming? Oh, this is what I was talking about. Mega boss engaged. Prepare massive anal rupture component. Oh shit, it's X Shepherd. Never mind. I shall prepare my anus for eruption or whatever it's called. Yeah, you better prepare your anus for eruption. I'm about to make that fucking. I'm about to break that ass. You hear that, Liara? Same goes for you, wink wink. A little bit later tonight. Oh, it's just one of you! Oh, I should've known. Oh crap, I can't drive over their shields! And they haven't even touched my shields. Oh, it's a crate. Oh, he got up! <laughs> yeah, this place is a joke. But that's a crate. Those are crates. There's no enemies on... Oh god! Oh god, look at that hazard bar fill up. Come on, it's, it's fucking cold, let's go. Let's go, it's fucking cold out here. Hold on, I'm gonna spend some time hacking. Don't worry, I can do it basically instantly. Time stops, so. We're, we're golden, baby. Oh, I went the wrong way. <laughs> oh, a new biotic amp. I think we only have like level one versions of those for everybody. Survivor four for a Turian, that could be cool. Phoenix four for me, all right. We'll have to look into that kind of stuff later, because it's fucking cold out here! Oh, begin manual over it. Oh, this one's easy. There must be something in here we're supposed to find. Stinger, Edge, Scorpion, maybe not. Okay. Um, but that biotic amp. Recovered items. Wait, none of these were the ones I used before. Are these the loot from the mobs I killed? Is that technically how this works? I thought this was just a recap of things I looted in the crates and things. Um, yeah, we haven't had any biotic amps. Or Omni Tool, I don't think that I've seen anyway show up. Oh my God! It's so much of an upgrade. All right, Liara, you just became like a super enchanter, like EverQuest enchanter. Man, man, EverQuest enchanter may be like the best class in any video game ever made. Not even gonna lie. It could not solo. It was entirely, well, it was like 98% dependent on being in a group. But if an enchanter was in the group, that group was way more powerful than its number. That's why I loved being an enchanter. Well, that was a cool turn. Son! Yeah, now I can... 400 years, that sun's gonna explode. I just doomed this planet. Oh, 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 didn't see those. I was too busy laughing about the sun and dooming this planet. But my shields are full again anyway, so I guess it doesn't matter. Let's just go up and see what they do. You guys have no shields. Get up. Why is this section so free? And look at those colors in there. Oh my goodness. Man, if you are not high when you are watching this playthrough, you are doing yourself a disservice. Assuming you're a stoner already. I'm not, I'm not saying anybody go start weed just to watch my playthroughs, or at all. It's definitely a lot of risks to make. A lot of, a lot of things to consider before starting weed. My default recommendation is don't, but I am one of the people who loves the stuff, so kind of a double-edged recommendation, non-recommendation there. But there are long-term effects, there are short-term effects, and lots of things to consider. I've never heard any two people with the same story about how they started and how it's going for them. So, you know. If you like your life, just don't. <laughs> if you don't, I mean... <laughs> you know, even if you don't, there's a chance it makes it worse, so... Up to you. 
just know everything about it before you get into it. But man, if you're already a stoner and you haven't been token up during this series, I feel like you've been missing out. The visuals are just, whoa! Okay, there's something across there. Oh, that's the, that's the next area I'm gonna be going through. Holy shnikes, I didn't expect to see that. Aha! Wow, from way over there, huh? Wow, I can hit it from here. Just like he can hit me. Ow. He hit my tire. Yeah, I fear absolutely nothing moving up here. Nope. That's where I was. It's kind of cool for like slightly sharper turns. Oh, you loved that. You loved that. Let's not fall off. Let's not fall off. In fact, quick save. Is that a... Oh, that's the one I already got. So then what's... What am I seeing? Must be around the corner. Yep. Whoop. Aha. Looks like we're going inside. This peak 15, as we've been hearing about. Oh, that looks cool. Damn, look at that. Not, not my ass. Look at that. The tower. <laughs> Damn, look at that ass. This would be a good opportunity for photo mode, but I don't feel like dealing with it. But yeah, Shepard's got that Patreon ass. Actually. <laughs> See, Liara's got that Patreon ass. Hold still. Let's show everybody. See what I mean? Right there. Right there. So what you do is you start with the thumb and you put it... <laughs> Everybody, get serious! We're going in. Got the shotgun at the ready. Now let's do pistol. I think my pistol skill is a little better than my shotgun skill. My helmet is gone. All right, get the fuck in here. It's fucking cold, man. Come in. And Liara's stuck. Liara is stuck outside. Come on. Add a girl. Both of you get in here. <laughs> Liara, you're not very good at doors. <laughs> there you go. Had a girl. Oh, oh, this place looks awesome. What do we got? What are we messing with over here? Sniper rifle at the ready. Garrus, I want you there. Is that a grenade? I missed. Oh my god, the Juggernaut takes so much HP damage. Whoop, all right. Shotgun time. Okay, he's just annihilating the whole lot of us. So, what we do here, give us a shield boost to start. Let's go ahead and use Unity to bring the Aura back. Then we'll meta gel. And she's down again. All right. F3, shift. Immunity for shield wall. End him. All right, there I was down. Hey, that guy was actually not as tough as I thought. He was just dealing so much damage, I thought he was going to be a lot tougher than that. So I used a lot of my cooldowns. We need to get Liara back up. She's our crowd control. Although, there's only one unit in there looking at the radar. Uh, maybe two? Easy peasy. Where's the second guy? I know I just took some fire. Garrus? Move on up. We gotta clear this room so Liara reses. The museum is hot. The museum is hot? Yeah, I agree. Actually, I could... Well, it's already half gone. Or half done. Half cooled down. Crap, I gotta sneeze! Muting the mic! Ah! 
Mike's unmuted. This is the best fight I've ever been in. <laughs> oh, that got you moving. Oh! One more back there, says Radar. Oh, those can move. Alright, Gary, so you want to charge in? Oh, there you go. Made himself known. I really like the pistol. There's still one more off to the right. Oh, he's got a shield wall up. Pistol's overheated, so we'll swap to this and say, boom, headshot. Get him, my man. Oh, get him. Oh, he's, re oh, he's healing. <laughs> but for how long? Boom. Hey, you don't shoot a man when he's down. That's dishonorable. Just kidding. Ah, I was going to take the kill. All Peak 15 facilities have suffered a great deal of damage. Biohazard materials present throughout facility. Virtual intelligence user interface offline. We'll need to get the reactors back online. What has happened? Why do we need to get those reactors back online? I missed out on that. Hmm. Alright, I'll trust you. I was a little distracted commentating, so as long as you're on the ball, Garrus, I think we're fine. Uh, do I have a heal? I think... Didn't I pick up a heal ability? I didn't. Did Liara? Singularity, throw, lift, warp, stasis. Barrier, did you have a heal? Adrenaline burst, sabotage, overload. I'm glad these guys are using their own stuff. That way I don't gotta worry about it. Shield boost, immunity, immunity, adrenaline burst. I thought I picked up a heal. Maybe that's later. Maybe that's on my plan. Alright, fine. We have six metagel. Let's use one. Just for Liara's sake. Alright, I think we're good. I want the camera to zoom back a bit, so I have a better feel of, better sense of place here. Don't like the cold, huh? Or maybe you just don't like your mom. That's what I'm banking on. Doo -doo -doo. Oh. So we go like this. Doo -doo. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Oops. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Oops. Okay, I suck. What could possibly be in there? How much Omni Gel do I have? Uh, take all the body loot. Is this Omni Gel? This is. I'm not gonna spend 20 on that. Okay, I wanna j jump beside this one and then find a way. There we go. <clears throat> stinger, hurricane, tsunami. Wow, all level. Ooh, Stinger 4! I think I need that! I have a Stinger 2. No other pistol. Not even an Edge 3, which is a level above a Stinger 2. Uh, no other pistol has matched the Stinger. So we've stuck on a level 2 Stinger for the longest time. And now we got four. We've got two level fours. Yeah, baby. Let's do it. And transfer the mods, of course. Someone else needs one, too. Garrus. You are my combat guy. Oh, you're using an Edge. Uh, the Stinger is better. But maybe it's a bigger upgrade for Liara. Oh, she's using a Kessler 4. Oh, excuse me. Um, all right, I'll give it to Garrus because he's using a three. Hell yeah, that was fucking awesome. Okay, that was so worth hacking that. Might as well quick save. Something I have learned to do. Upgrades. Polonium rounds. What is this? Have we seen those? Oh, apparently we have. All good. Uh, oh shit, I thought those were Geth. Wait, they're trying to keep something in, not out? Why are the turrets facing the wrong way? Right. They want to keep their people in as much as they want to keep others out. Damn, your mom sucks! I do not like this place. Too many dark secrets. So it's not the cold. 
Arcturians don't like the cold, Shepard. Did I ever mention that? All right, all right, I get it. You both want out. Fine, we'll push forward. He's like, they're both like, I know you're doing YouTube commentary, but can you hurry the fuck up? Eyewitnesses report today seeing Liara's butt giving news messages when news messages should not be received. When asked for comment, Shepard said, yeah, I installed an FM radio in that bitch. All right, here we go. Oh, that's a shotgun. Take cover. Not the weapon I was intending to use, but it should take out shields easily enough. Pistol, pistol, pistol. Come on, Liara, get us. Get us some crowd control, Liara. Gotta move, gotta move. I'm trying to get up front. I am the tank. Take that out so it's not a danger to me. All good, baby. What was that? Animals, wind. This place is in bad shape. Yeah. It's definitely animals. Oh, shit. It is animals. <laughs> but come on. Ah, God! The fuck? Get him! I don't know what to do. I can't tank that. Okay, you guys are poisoned. That's bad. We got mobs up here. Boosh! Thank you, well done. What were those things? Xenobiology is not my field. Maybe someone in the labs knows. Graphitic weapons research. Ah, uh, yes. All clear. Glad to hear it. You guys are still toxicified. Ooh, a Raikou 4. I don't know if we've heard of a Raikou before. Well, that was a weird sentence. Pistola? Raikou? Uh, it's a little bit better DPS, but worse in every other regard. Hmm. I think I like my stinger. All right. Oh, that's glass. Area secure. Good, a medical kit. Let's heal you guys up. Refill the meta gel, which said zero. I don't know why we didn't end up using one. What? Man, that crowd control is so good. Perimeter secure. You're secure. <laughs> Both of you come in here. I don't want to leave anybody out. Alright, good. It's a good thing we're in this elevator where it's nice and warm. Looks warm. Was it warm, Garrus? That was too easy. Negative uh, contacts. All right, if you say so. A backup power system, Commander. It must be for the station's mainframe. The damage is not extensive. It could be repaired. Critical startup error. Virtual intelligence user interface offline. Manual boot required. Okay. Probably should have brought Kaden. Probably should have brought Tali. Ah. They're all locked. Carefully. With the plates. A core. To roof and comms. Yeah, if you say so. This must be station... Okay, Mira, yeah. Station virtual inter... Intelligence? Intelligence. 
sooner we are off this frozen world, the better. Am I going down or is this going up? I'm going down. Oh, bye, everybody! Shit. Oh. The VI core appears inoperational. Inoperative? You can attempt to manually reconfigure the databanks or use Omnigel to repair the damage systems. I don't even think I have 100 Omnigel. Let's try it manually, baby! Oh. Memory core 1 damage. To transfer module stack to core 2 or 3 to reactivate. Click the shutdown button to exit. Um. Okay, so it's always the top one that gets placed first. So we'll do this. I assume they have to be contiguous for this to work. No, you can't stick that in there. Oh, I guess all of these just have to be in... Oh, okay, all of these active cores just have to be in either one of these to activate it. That's what that tooltip or the instructions at the start meant. Okay, so we're going to move core 3. To, no, actually, we can leave core 3. Could have done that. Core two. Okay, so there has to be at least one adjacent to it. So this should be fine now, and then we can do this. No? Okay, core three has to have n nothing on it then. We gotta take the top of core three, move it to core one. I'm gonna stack this on top of this one. And the top one goes here, the mid one goes here, this one now goes to one, and we stack this on top of three, and then to three. Okay, yeah. It took a second to figure out what they wanted me to do, and then it became quite clear. It looks like you're trying to restore this facility. Would you like help? <laughs> <laughs> they did that if they did that on purpose. They did the clippy thing on purpose. <laughs> it looks like you're trying to restore this facility. Bink, bink. You know how Clippy used to tap the monitor? Bink, bink. Looks like you're trying to restore this facility. They did that on purpose. I would love to talk to the devs. In fact, I'm sure they've already talked about it. Uh, would you like help? <laughs> Crap, a pop-up. How do I shut this thing up? This system is monitored to respond to the name Mira. May I ask your name? All right. I don't want to shut this thing up. She's nice. She's kind. Um, I'm pouring my coffee. I forgot I had coffee, so I get to enjoy really hot coffee now. In the middle of a recording session, when normally it's starting to get about room temperature already, but now, right in the middle, mm. May I ask your name? Um, I'm not gonna say I'm a specter. Yeah, I don't want to give another person's computer my identity. Why do you need to know? To determine the data access available to you. Ah! Basic access is limited to non-secure queries. Secure access allows most system functions. Privileged access is available only to executives of Binary Helix. All right, well, guess what? Commander Shepard, I work for the Citadel Special Tactics and Reconnaissance. One moment, please. Council authority confirmed. You are entitled to secure access of all systems. Please note that queries relating to corporate secrets require privileged access. Privileged access is only available to Binary Helix executives. Okay. This system is ready to process queries. You may access me at any holographic interface within Peak 15. I need to find Matriarch Benezia. Lady Benezia departed on the passenger tramway to the Rift Station subsidiary labs. User alert. The tramway system is currently inoperable. What's the situation here? 
One moment, please. Diagnostics in progress. Critical failure. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Uh. Manual restart required. Critical failure. Landline connections are disabled. Passenger tram systems are offline. Report complete. Do you have an additional system status query? So I need to restore the main reactor. Um, actually, what are the purposes for the main reactor? I know I need to restore the landline so I have access to the tram. And probably we have to restore the main reactor because there is a containment breach. A containment of those creatures that they were working on here. Venezia is working on these organic creatures that are very crowd controllable but are toxic. And the main reactor only shut down because of the containment breach which locks a bunch of doors. The landlines are shut down. I don't know if those are supposed to shut down um, automatically. They may have been destroyed to cover Benezia's tracks because she got out as soon as the containment breach happened. That's my guess. And then she cut the proverbial rope bridge behind her once she made it across. Um, what else can we even ask Tell about what here? Happened here? I'm sorry, but I need a more specific query. Ooh. Tell me what occurred immediately before you shut down. Stage one alert issued at Hot Labs. Contaminants released from Laboratory Pod Gamma. Emergency protocols implemented. Stage two alert issued at Hot Labs. Isolation two breached. Tram shut down. Landline to Hot Labs disconnected. Stage three alert issued locally. Contaminants in tram tunnels. Ah. Station shut down and evacuation initiated. Code Omega sent. What sort of contaminants escaped? I'm sorry, Commander. Inquiries related <sighs> to our research require privileged access. Only executives of Binary Helix have that level of clearance. The creatures we've encountered here, did they come from the labs? I'm sorry, Commander. Yeah. Inquiries related to our research require privileged access. Only executives of Binary Why were you taken offline? In the event, Peak 15 must be sterilized for security purposes. My program and data are purged. <laughs> they kill you? No, that's not what I would ask. <clears throat> that's all I need right now. Very well, Commander. Logging you out. <clears throat> and I can access... User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. I thought I just did manually restart her. That's what the whole core thing User was. User alert. Online. How may I assist you? Do you know why the reactor was shut down? I'm sorry, but I was offline at the time. 